Let's go, Dazzlers! Welcome back to Daz Games, and we're back with another Daz Watches. Today's children usually stay inside playing on their many devices that they're very lucky to have. Xboxes, PCs, iPads. There really is no reason to go outside. However, growing up, I had to settle for such things like riding bikes like the Stranger Things kids, or going to a play park or playground. It involved getting kids out and swinging them around on chains. Watching them climb up metal ladders only to some kid run into it and knock themselves out. But some people shouldn't be left to design a child's play park. Or anything related to children in that matter. And we're going to find out why because today we're going to be reacting to a video called Hilariously Inappropriate Playground Design Fails That Are Hard To Believe Were Approved. It's basically a compilation of pictures of uh, real play parks and real child equipment <laughs> that has been made, produced, approved, and put out there for children to play on and with. And some of it is very wrong. Let's watch the video! God. Why is his head bent back like that? And why is it in between his legs? He's like... <laughs> if you send your child in there, it's technically abuse. But why is it red as well? Who designed that? Jesus. It literally just drops your child out onto the floor. It's gotta be in Russia, right? You go down slide, you fall on face, you get up and you do it again. <laughs> wow! Oh, emo Thomas the Tank Engine. No one knows what it's like to be a train. <laughs> Look at that! It's like the paint has run off of its eyes and it's crying. Playgrounds are meant to be adventurous and like striking and visually wonderful. That, that just looks like mum from a weekend bender and she's been crying and the mascara's run off her face. It's terrifying. <laughs> Hell no. Hell no. What is that? What? I mean, I know that's technically how kids come into this world, but why are we replicating it here? What's that the end of? Do your children love Barney the Dinosaur? Well, we have his penis. <laughs> that's terrible. That's bad. That's terrible. Why? Hold on. Apparently this is from South Korea. I... D There's so much going on here. Why... Why is, is there what looks like, ah, uh, and why is that kid putting his shirt up and they're all in his legs? Some sort of human centipede shit. I'm struggling to work out what kids can do. Even if this is some sort of game in North Korea, what can you do with that? I tell you what, that has been visited, but not by children. <laughs> What are we supposed to do with this? Is that like, are they like peeing? Or or is that meant, you know, are you meant to be swinging off their dong? I don't wanna walk under it. Why are they babies? I don't know, I don't know. Again, this has to be Russian or Korean. What the shit? Where's his head gone? Why have they built it without a head? And why have they done, gone to so much detail? So I reckon it's happened here. I reckon either someone sawed it off and drew that on there to scare the children. Or it was originally designed like that, but someone's painted the end red to kind of make it look like it's been beheaded. I don't believe they'd build a zebra like that. What is that? That's so, why is the writing up there? Learning Braille. Look how tall it is. <laughs> no child is that tall enough to learn Braille. Oh lord, no. Imagine imagine living in this part here and waking up and there's like Tom Holland's asshole. <laughs> sure, I think there's a few I think there's a few girls that would actually like to climb inside of Tom Holland's asshole, and now you get the chance to do it. It's just really bad, isn't it? It's just such a bad design. Like and the fact that the webbing joins right where you know, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> 
Jesus, is that meant to be Mickey Mouse? Has he been in the sun all day? <laughs> Kill me! <laughs> That's like a really, that's like Mickey Mouse's cousin. That's Nicky Mouse. That's not Mickey Mouse. All right. I had to look at this one a few times, but I get it. If you go down and your legs aren't pointing down straight, you're, you're going to crunch your nuts on these bits. That is quite poorly designed, isn't it? Why don't people think these through before they make them? But surely people can't be that stupid. Wow. <laughs> wow. That is a child in between the chef's nuts, isn't it? Why would you make anything this shape in the child world? In clothing, toys, theme park. Why? Nothing has to be that shape. Unless it is a knob. Uh, she's going to grow up. Right now, she's like, I'm having fun, mum. She's going to look back at that photo in 10 years and think, mum, why did you do that? That's meant to be a pizza, right? And the chef's in the middle. What's this bit? What's that bit represent? That that chef is sticking his dick in the pizza. That's what I'm reckoning. <laughs> oh Jesus, just another Russian playground. Look at that. Oh, you know what this this um empty urban car park is missing? A slide. Look at it. Look at it. Is is that the only planning permission they got for a playground? Poor bastards. <laughs> Christ! Looks like the elephant's prolapsed! Look at it! These animal themed rides, you need to be careful where you put the tubes. Why would you want to come out the back end of an African elephant? Wow. <laughs> wow. There are these little ride on things in the mall that you sit on and they sort of their legs move and they you sort of see kids riding them. Why is SpongeBob's face? <laughs> <laughs> melted onto this creation. That's terrifying. If I saw that coming at me at a mall, I'd slap it. <laughs> Holy crap. I'll do it. Hold on. Wait. <laughs> hold on, hold on. It's because I know what I've got in my head. Oh, where are you taking the kids this weekend, Julie? Oh, we're going to go and let them climb on Vector's dick. Vecna from Stranger Things, yeah. <laughs> what? Come on, though. What? What is that? Look, at it's even got a little... They knew what they were doing. There's no way they did not know what they were doing when they built this. It's even got the little ridge there. That's a knob. That is Vecna's knob. Oh, crap. Sorry, I thought that was hilarious. <clears throat> that is actually close up what Miley Cyrus's tongue looks like. <laughs> Put it under a microscope. All the things she's licked. <laughs> Wait, is that cow all right? It's got mad cow disease. Why has he got three tongues? Welcome one and all to the opening of the Chernobyl cow. <laughs> oh, that is horrendous. And again, look, you can climb out of its ass. These, these play parks have got a disturbing fetish of climbing out of arseholes. <laughs> Never. Never is that real. I can see it, what it is. It's a pirate holding a sword. But why is he hold? No one goes into a sword fight with it on their crutch. Come on in. Come on. <laughs> no one! When have you ever seen a sword fight with that? And why is it flaccid? I know why. Because he's at a children's park. You've got to look where, if you're going to have to build a phallus shaped object, make sure it's not in a, you know, in a place like that. Oh, Pirates of the Caribbean, that's Pirates of the Chlamydia. Come on. Come on. Who wants to 69 with Donald Duck? Why would you sit on him like that? At least ride his back or something. Like, turn him over. Why has he got to be making eye contact? <laughs> I don't know what that was. <laughs> that was meant to be Donald Duck. <laughs> My God! Did they run out of budget? 
Is that meant to be The Simpsons? Why does Marge look like that Snapchat filter I keep seeing? Maggie's turned into bloody Wolverine. She looks got metal claws. That's, that's so unattractive. <laughs> yep. North, West, South, East. You know, teaching them correct. <laughs> again, again, you see what I mean? There are other orifices for you to come out of if you're gonna build a lifelike figure. I don't even know what that is. What is that man? You're going up through his ass and down out of his out of his knob. I don't get and they're building this why they think, ah. I know, children want to climb up a, a man who looks like he beats his wife and, <laughs> and out through his underwear. Jesus Christ. They should investigate people who sign these off. Now, this, you know, holding onto Spider-Man's back, I can kind of get it. But his, his ass makes me uncomfortable. The rest of him is like, like his hand, his arm, his neck. Everything's kind of poorly designed. But his ass is amazing. And he's got, they've even gone to the detail of putting a underwear line. Like he's got a wedgie. Why would you go into so much detail on Spider-Man's ass? I wouldn't put my kid on that. They might, if they enjoyed it, I'd be worried. Now, now, now. Why does it have lips? Like, they've not made it look like a door they have made it look like a vagina look that kid is face deep in snowman poon look look at that guy watching as well that's his job he has to stand there and watch parents thrust their kids through a snowy vagina i don't, <laughs> I don't know why is this in an arena where is this horrific i think we'll leave it there like that <laughs> that's that's enough of that guys i hope you enjoyed today's video if you're going to take your kid to a child play park and any of the featured products are in there, just walk the other way and go somewhere else. Thank you so much for suggesting today's video. Like, love, caress my channel. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay dazzling.